Hey guys, welcome back. It's Raptor Prometheus again, and this time I've got a very special video for you guys. This time, I'm going to be showing a first look at the Diamondback, which is the new Spy Revolver from the Deus Ex promo items. So, I was very surprised at Valve for this, and I'm very happy to say that these are not just reskins, all these guns. They're real, brand new weapons, each with their own effects that are very unique. Well, this one's effect actually isn't very unique. You'll see, uh, you'll see shortly, and I'll tell you why. So, there's a couple aesthetic items released, too, but I'll get into those later. You could see me taunt at the beginning of the video, and I had the new, uh, spy hat, and then I put on the, uh, the Deus Specs, which are the glasses, which I really like. They look really cool. Getting back to the point, this gun has two effects, and you can tell that Valve was really taking advantage of TF2 as sort of like a guinea pig it, for these sorts of effects. So, the effects are, the first one is much more simple. It's that it deals 15% less damage. So, it deals less damage than a normal revolver. But, the second effect is really the kicker. So, much like revenge crits, when a building is destroyed with your sapper attached, you get a crit. You know, and you can see the crit uh, counter at the bottom right. You know, that goes up one, two, three, four as you destroy buildings. And since it does 15% less damage, a crit will deal the same amount of damage as an ambassador headshot. So if anybody knows that off the top of your head, that's how much damage it'll deal. So unfortunately, I only really take advantage of the effect once because of this guy. And spoiler alert, I missed the shot because I'm a scrub. But the idea is that it proves the, my next point, which is don't use this gun. Don't be dumb like me and use this gun when there aren't really any engineers. Because if you do, you're just giving up the extra damage offered by the revolver or the, uh, the enforcer and the ambassador. Use it only when there's a bunch of aloof engineers or a bunch of combat engineers. You know, guys who don't really pay attention or are, they don't really care. So that way you can just easily get crits and kill them and, yeah, that sort of thing. So, yeah, that's about it for this gun, though. There isn't much really else to say. It's good when there's a lot of engineers, like I said, because then you can really amass a lot of crits and just let loose. And so this will be the first of a couple of videos. I have another one on the way. I will try to release a gameplay, like a real gameplay, using this weapon, because I know this one was only really... A quick first look it's a very short video and I didn't really take advantage of the effect that much I'll try to record a much better gameplay where I get lots where I actually get a kill with the crits and get a few and that sort of thing but yeah more videos of these items will be on the way I am ex I'm just so happy to be able to actually bring some of an actual first look for once thank you very much for watching the video is gonna come to a close soon like I said for the third time more are on the way if you want to check back later. Hope to see you guys again. Thanks for watching. Yeah, see ya.